I love the way this jumper looks in these lights. This is adorable and so shiny! What's up guys and welcome to day 9 of 12 days of Christmas. I can't believe how quickly these have gone. It makes me a little bit sad. Today is going to be a very quick and snappy video. <laughs> I'm so funny! About one of my favourite things. Candles. Now I love candles. 365 days a year, but as you will have seen from my room tour at the start of the month, and if you haven't seen that, link will be in the description, please give it a watch. You will know and will have seen that I favour them slightly more at this time of year. Some may call it obsession, I don't like to. <laughs> Basically because of that I thought I would let you all see my favourite festive candles. First candle I have is called Bundle Up and it is by Yankee Candle. It is no secret that I love the brand Yankee Candle. I do think their candles are a bit expensive sometimes but nevertheless this one is from Yankee Candle and I want to start off by saying that I am very gutted and very disappointed in myself because I only had a few votes of these in the scent and I wish I had a bigger candle because I've grown to love it so much. It pretty much smells it pretty much smells like a Christmas tree to me. Um, the votives don't actually have written on it anywhere what the scent actually is or what it consists of, which is actually quite nice because in my mind, I smell Christmas trees and if I was to find out that it's anything other than that, which no doubt it probably is, I would be heartbroken because, oh, it's just, it's, it's my Christmas tree. <laughs> it's a really nice fresh scent. It's not too strong, it's more of like a, background scent is something that you could potentially leave burning all day and it wouldn't overpower you but it's just oh so good it actually it does just remind me of this time of year oh can i eat you the next one i have is a lily flame candle because i tried their cranberry crush candle last year and was very very impressed it became one of my favorites last year I think, did I actually buy it again? I think I did. I'm pretty sure I bought it again in like the February or something because I missed the smell after a wee while. So it definitely left an impression. So I wanted to try another Lily Flame Christmas candle and I went for this one which is called Mistletoe Kisses. Very adorable. As you will have guessed, again, like all Lily Flame candles, this looks gorgeous. Very festive colour scheme here. It just looks like Christmas and it smells Honestly, this is gonna sound ridiculous. This smells like my grandpa. I always hug him and I always say, oh, you smell nice. And he always jokes about what it is, but this is exactly like it. Oh my God. On the website, it actually says, to be frank, this smells very similar to the Holly Hill candle, but a little sweeter with more floral notes. And that is the most accurate description ever. Holly Hill is really green scented, if that makes sense, and earthy almost. This is a little bit fresher than that. I'm very interested to see what this is going to be like when I actually burn it because I'm not going to lie, I was putting it off while I was wanting to film this video because I look, look at it! Another big favourite of mine is a candle that I've spoken about so many times before that to be honest I don't have anything new to say about it anymore but I just wanted to give it a quick shout out because it is one of my festive favourites and that of course is Autumn by Bath & Body Works. It's apples and fig and eucalyptus oil and fur in heaven. <laughs> it's amazing with or without burning it just leaving this in a room with the lid off that would be enough. I want to eat it. I actually want to know what it tastes like but I won't because that's just a step too far. What is next? I can't find my other candles. Oi! Okay now this biggie is another candle that I've spoken about before but it was only once last Christmas I think because last year was the first time that I bought the Yankee Candle Candy Cane Lane scent and it must have made a good impression because it's back! It smells of mint and vanilla and chocolate and maybe a little bit of gingerbread warming it up a smidge. It really does give that kind of sweet festive scent that you want this time of year but although it is a sweet scent it will never get sickly or at least I won't find it sickly. It never kind of builds to that point where you're like Ew. And I'm going to light it for the remainder of this video. Also before I forget, if you like the sound of that scent but you don't want to go paying the ridiculous amount of money that Yankee candles do often cost, the As The Home section have a candy cane candle that smells almost identical to that and they also have a mint chocolate one as well, I think it's called mint chocolate. 
or mint chalk chip or something along those lines. So you can try those if you want a similar kind of vibe. This last candle is yet another Yankee candle. I feel really gutted that I haven't got to try so many different brands or at least as many brands as I would like to but it's just because I had so many as gifts and I had so many kind of stored away and I wanted to use them before I bought any more and then I realised I had more than I thought. Just the vicious candle cycle is what I live in. But anyway, this was a newly purchased candle because as far as I'm aware, this was a newly released scent this year called Festive Cocktail. It does not specify which cocktail, but it should just be called happiness because that is exactly what this smells like. You instantly get a bit of citrus, a little bit of cranberry crumbing through, but when you burn it, you actually get quite a nice vanilla scent through it, which is nice. This is possibly slightly overtaking my love for the Candy Cane Lane candle. Um, maybe, I will not hold myself to that. My judgment is subject to change, but it just, it just smells so good. It actually smells like a cocktail that I would happily drink any day of the week. Oh my goodness, after that you have no idea how much I wish Smell-O-Vision was a thing. Get your crap together, technology. God! But besides our technological shortcomings, I do hope you enjoyed this quick little video. If you did, you know what to do. Click the like button, subscribe for more videos, but other than that, much love you guys and I shall see you all tomorrow. Bye!